living it and welcome to another travel vlog just made it safely here in Paris I'm with my BFF since 2004 we got here from Amsterdam using a Flix bus now it's not sponsored but I highly recommend for you guys to check out Flix bus whenever you're traveling around Europe because it saves a lot of money we only paid 45 euros for the both of us for a seven hour journey to Paris from Amsterdam if you buy train tickets it will cost about a hundred plus euros also for the flight tickets just one way if you're a budget traveler if you're a backpacker I highly recommend for you guys to check out Flix bus all right so now we're just trying to figure out where we can ride an uber because we both have huge luggages so it's better to be safe and pay extra a little bit extra just to get to our hotel all right okay are you ready struggle is real let's go <laughs> oh not gonna lie it's quite hot you're gonna book an uber go to this hotel try to pin the pickup point here our uber driver just dropped us off and oh my gosh what started in taft now we're here started in vito cruz now we're here <laughs> yes so this is our hotel where is our hotel this oh this one go out there <laughs> See you later. What about your? I'll just bring this. Bye. Bye. So this is our small room. <laughs> it's how much is this? Um, this is like two hundred dollars, four hundred dollars for two nights. So this hotel costs four hundred dollars for two nights. Can you imagine? Welcome to Paris, where everything is expensive. Of course, you know. Hey, hold on. Sa kabilang side. I think here. I joke. At least we have a huge window. True. Especially that it's so hot. Right now, the question is, how will we be able to open our luggages? Yun lang. One at a time. One at a time, sis. <laughs> <laughs> Grocery shopping. <laughs> We're at the supermarket for lunch. village which is quite far from central Paris it will take us about an hour and 20 minutes to get there also freshened up you know change clothes because it's super hot as well as our fanny packs I have my yes of course better be safe than sorry as if they're gonna get a lot from me no? yeah <laughs> a week ago, my friends were here and they experienced pickpockets, even snatchers. So please be careful when you're here in Paris, especially if you're a tourist. All right, we just went down at the Val de Europe station after an hour being inside the train. We're just walking towards La Valle. Wow, La Valle Bouquet Le Bou. Oui, oui. I know you <laughs> I don't know. Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> Need to walk 
for 10 minutes. This is my exercise. As you all know, I don't go to the gym. <laughs> I don't do any sports anymore. So, walking, traveling is my it's sport. <laughs> for I don't know how many minutes now I just heard that this mall is one kilometer long if you want to go to the toilet go to this mall because the toilet is free I think I'm okay to buy some things today I'm feeling a little bit generous for myself no for me generous for myself myself and I yes <laughs> Balochaga, guys, ready to go to the palenque. Oh my gosh, started as crocs. Now we here, and the from kitchen, guys, for chefs. <laughs> Ma'am, tara na po. Alika na. Amin na po yung iba niyong gamit. Ako na po magbibitbit. Good girl. Saan po tayo next? Okay, you have to fall in line. You know, just like in a theme park. This is the ride. <laughs> buying this one or this one both in black so that I can easily pair it up with most of my clothes that I wear um, I'm just really struggling which one to choose because this one is more for formal this one is travel friendly and I think you can put more stuff in it so hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so 
sorry the old abbot can come to the phone right now. <laughs> you know. Are you happy? Yes. I'm so proud I'm of so you. Started in Ukay Ukay. Mark this day, June 27th. Oh no, 28th. 28th. 2019. <laughs> okay, now I need to edit a lot of vlogs, post more vlogs, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, this mall is huge. <laughs> back here in Oslo, Norway. What's up? I've been editing a lot of videos that I will be publishing within this week. I'm super excited to share to you guys all of my travel vlogs. I decided to make a haul at the end of this video instead of the regular travel guide travel vlogs. I always tell this in almost every travel vlog that I post. Spend your money in life experiences than material things and that is true. I'd rather buy a plane ticket than you know, buy a luxury brand. There's just this me being always on a budget. Hey, I can buy a plane ticket to Morocco, plane ticket to Europe. I also saved up a lot of money this year, which is I'm pretty proud of. I thought about, hey, why not buy yourself something that you can also pass to your, I don't know, grandchildren, your future daughter. When I was at the outlet store, I was like, hey, Man. I know to myself if I enter that store, I will buy something. So I went to the store I was contemplating whether to buy it or not If I buy this bag in the Philippines or in Asia, it will cost like twice the price. My heart was beating so fast as soon as I swiped my card and I was like, better get approved. Most of the bags that I have are travel friendly. It's either a backpack, a sling bag, a fanny pack. So first off, I have my first Balenciaga bag. It's literally a bag because it's just a paper bag. <laughs> There's nothing in it. You know, I can't just walk around and tell people, hey, I have a Balenciaga bag. A paper bag, at least. I would like to say thank you to my best friend for giving this to me. She bought two bags and I asked if I can get the other paper bag and she said yes. So I'm pretty happy with my Balichaga paper bag. One day I will have this one. Um, I know I'm not sure when, but uh, maybe I will. Who knows if I will buy. This is the only bag that I actually bought. It's a Prada. <laughs> I've seen the movie. I don't know why I'm like so teary. But I've seen the movie The Devil Wears Prada. And I was like, oh, I've always wanted a Prada bag. I haven't, I haven't actually unboxed it. So it says Prada. I wanted to use this when I was in Paris, but told myself, oh, there's a lot of pickpockets in Paris, so better not 
be too flashy. A lot of my friends had experiences with pickpockets in Paris. They are really aggressive. Always be aware of your surroundings. Try as much as possible not to wear too flashy clothes. So here it is. Ta -da! I was contemplating on the smaller one but then I was like you know I travel a lot and I'd rather get a convenient mom bag I call this a mom bag oh I didn't know there's like embroidered things going on inside so this is what I got oh I actually haven't explored this bag I just as soon as I saw it I was like oh my gosh I like this it's classic you can wear different types of clothes and can still match with this bag because it's black it's plain it's simple like your girl simple without any makeup on even if i, I probably look so ratchet right now it has a pocket outside oh it smells so good <laughs> where you can put some of your i don't know like small items like coins this is what it looks like inside I don't know if you can see it, but there's like Prada, Prada, Prada embroidered inside. There's a pocket which has no zipper and there's another one with zipper. There's also a card. Oh, Prada. I am so happy. Sorry. It also has a sling. So when I travel, I can just easily, you know, clip the sling. You know, wear it like this or make it as a body bag so it's really cute i'm super happy about this it has this golden accent i really love it and i'm so proud of myself for buying my first luxury brand at the age of 20 something so yeah this is my per first Prada bag and this also ends my outlet shopping in Paris vlog if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up comment below what you guys think about my new bag I'll see you guys on the next travel vlog bye Ow. peace